It's a great American tradition. Blowing up the candles on your birthday cake. Plus, everyone's but tradition, no? really a good idea? <laughs> oh. Happy birthday! Here at Inset Edition, it's a birthday Happy celebration, birthday and the cool. office is throwing 25-year-old Alyssa Bonito a party. There's no way they're doing that for it's everyone, by the tell, way. It's hard to tell, but Alyssa is feeling a bit under the weather. <coughs> She's been coughing <coughs> and oh. blowing her nose all week. Right. Sometimes when you're sick, you don't look it, but you feel it. So we got to wondering, when you blow out those birthday candles, do you also send thousands of germs onto the cake? Probably. To get an idea how germs can travel, we put this cake under an ultraviolet light. This is how it looks before we blow out the candles. Cool. Then, using a fluorescent powder, I blow out the candles. Just look at the difference. The fluorescent marker shows how wow. a single breath I mean, you're, blow you're, germs onto a you're cake blowing and some, lead to on, possible you know what I mean? contamination. So what Obviously about that Alyssa's cake? First, we swabbed the cake for bacteria before Alyssa blew the candle. We swabbed again afterwards. Then sent them off to a lab to see if Alyssa's cold infected the birthday cake. Well, everyone's eating that Four weeks well, no later, cares. Alyssa, are you ready? I'm ready. We have the results. All right. Here's what we found. Eight different types of bacteria, including one called Staph aureus. It can cause skin infections and potentially dangerous, life-threatening pneumonia. Oh right. my God, that is not good. That's really bad. bad. Skin infections and pneumonia, you said? Yes. Wow. Pretty shocking. See, yeah. I didn't think it would be and that how bad. how many germs wound up on the cake? Before wow. the candles were blown out, according to the lab, the bacteria count was zero. After the candles were blown out, the amount of bacteria, according to the lab, was so high, the lab stopped counting after 5,000. The lab told us it was too numerous to count. Wow, that's a lot. See, okay, I knew it would have a bit. I did not think it would be that f***ing much or be that bad. But to be honest with you, though, right, I will take my chances. If I'm at someone's birthday party and someone has a f***ing nice cake, I'll take my chances. I think I'd be all right. It's one slice of cake. I'll take the chances, if the, especially if the cake looks really good. I'm still eating it. I don't give a f I am still eating that cake. I'm a fat guy, man. I want. I like my food, okay, and I'll still eat that cake. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Would you still eat the cake or not? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below.